Capital City Underground. I'm Cody Carlin. It was a little bit chilly this morning. You might need a jacket if you're out and about, but once those clouds moved out of the area, it made it warm up nicely. Currently, we are sitting at 70 degrees, partly cloudy. A little bit of chill in the air with that north wind at 15 to 20 miles an hour. However, we're going to see a steep drop off tonight in those temperatures. Low tonight is going to be all the way down to 33 degrees. We could see some areas of frost even, and that has prompted the National Weather Service to issue a frost advisory for Lincoln and even a freeze warning for parts of other parts of southeast Nebraska. Those winds will be sustained out of the north at 15 to 20 miles an hour. We'll see a rebound in temperatures tomorrow, 60 degrees, little bit cooler than normal for this time of year. 65 is what we see for our high temperature right about now. Sunny and north winds out of 5 to 10 miles an hour, so it won't be too bad with the wind. If you're heading up to Minnesota for this weekend to watch the Nebraska Cornhuskers take on the Minnesota Golden Gophers, it'll be a chilly one up there, especially if you're tailgating at 9 a.m., 38 degrees. Noontime temperature is going to be 45. Kickoff is going to be about 2.30. 51 and sunny. Those winds will be out of the, out of the west at 5 miles an hour. And at 6 p.m. when we're all celebrating a Cornhusker win, it'll be 49 degrees and clear. Taking a look at the rest of the week, it's going to be a little bit of a roller coaster ride this week. We have high temperatures 60 on Friday, Saturday 63, and both of those days look to be sunny. However, Sunday it's going to warm back up to 73 degrees. Monday we can see a high of 79. That is also the chance of some wet weather as well begins at the beginning of your work week on Monday. And even Tuesday we even see a chance for some thunderstorms. So even though it's going to be the third week in October, we're still seeing that slight chance for some thunderstorms. Now I did mention that we have a freeze, a freeze warning and frost advisory tonight. So here's Jake with a little bit more information on those.